Amen. Thank you guys for being here. You're Thank awesome. You. Thank you for having your, us. Your uh, heart is the prison ministry. Do you do other, other ministries? Well, you know, there's all can, different kind of aspects of ministry. You know, there's ministry for missionaries. He's he's a prison. We're, we consider ourselves prison ministry missionaries. He's senior missionary. I'm just a junior. I'm a little guy. I'm just a junior. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, you know, like the rest of our bike group, you know, we, we love on the homeless, take care of the needy, you know, um, widows and orphans. You know, there's all different kind of aspects of ministry, so we try to do it, a little bit of all of it. Do you go to Bike Week? Yes, ma'am, been to Bike Week. Now, what do you do? You will see things at Bike Week you never saw in the streets of right. America before. Mm -hmm. How do you handle that? Well, we try to stay in the, uh, we try not to get involved in all that. You know, we, we do a uh, outreach and, and uh, I think it's called Seeds of Hope is where we went to um, last time we were down there. And uh, I think we fed like 300 people and loved on people and shared Jesus with them. That's we don't, we don't try to get in all that main strip type stuff. You know, we'll, we'll do some street ministry and, and uh, share Jesus with some people, but we don't, we don't get in all the, all the worldly things. Mm -hmm. that, well... But you see it. It's just there. And you just have to plead the blood of Jesus That's over right. your eyes when you go there. That's right. Because it's strong. Exactly. I mean, you can feel it, can't you? Oh, it's bad. It's, it's a dark. very evil it's dark, dark presses. It sure is. And we, we also provide, uh, at Christmas time, we provide 1,200 care packages for the inmates. So it's not all just preaching. Oh, how uh, wonderful. To supply them with their basic needs. Now, how, how do you... Pick the ones. It's the ones that come to church. No, man, we, we do it for the whole prison. We have one prison that we kind of took over, and uh, we just take a we take twelve hundred care packages down there, and, and they just give them out to the guys, and uh, we just put a little note in there letting them know that they're loved. Um, so care packages would be soap, toothpaste, toothpaste. Yeah, shampoo. Mm -hmm. okay. I actually got a, a letter from an inmate that was on. He's actually been locked down since he's been at this prison. And he received one of our care packages at Christmas. And, uh, he what did just, he say? Just thanking us for, uh, for giving it to him. He said, I really have a bad case of dandruff. And the, the package that you gave us had dandruff shampoo in it. He said, and it's the first time I've gotten it since I've been locked up. And um, just uh, So it, it goes beyond just preaching, um, just being able to, to help him. Meeting all the whole person's needs. Yes, ma'am. Would you like other people to join you? Oh, yes, ma'am, most definitely. Talk to them. Uh, if you would like to, to be a partner with us, uh, you can reach uh, me, Larry Woods, at 706-386-6362. Uh, that's with Conviction Ministries. Uh, we would love for you to come beside us and just help us out, uh, getting across the message of Jesus Christ. Well, we have uh, their contact per people, and you can go to the phone and give us a call. They're still here. And talk to them and say, I would like to go and preach in the prison with you. Or I would like to become a part of the biker group, Sons of Thunder. That's right. Now, as Sons of Thunder, you know, that's what you guys do. But um, you go on bike rides and you do, what are some of the activities that you do? Well, we, we do, we've done a large variety of things. Like I say, we, you know, we've actually cooked for the for the needy and uh, we've done coat runs. Um, we provided a, over 150 coats down to Salvation Army. Um, uh, we've built wheelchair ramps. We, you know, just whatever the need is, we just get involved in um, di just different things. You know, whatever, whatever we can just show the love of Jesus with. We'll use that to sort of open the door. And that's wonderful. Oh, yeah. Larry, is there anything else you'd like to say before we go? Well, I was just noticing that your cameras kind of look like motorcycles in themselves. So we need to get out some bikes. <laughs> Put some wheels on them. Oh, they got yes, the wheels. <laughs> They're upright motorcycles. Yes, ma'am. The wheelies. That's right. <laughs> this is but doing. if anything else, if you could just be in prayer for me and Robbie as we go into these prisons, uh -huh. uh, we definitely need to be covered in prayer because we do go into a dark place. A lot of these people never have been to church in their life. And so we're fighting a lot of spiritual battles. Yes, you will. So if you could just keep us in prayers. Um, we're in a prison just about every week. Um, we, we do six across the state of Georgia right now. So we could definitely use prayers if nothing else. Let's pray. Father, right now in the name of Jesus, we lift up those that go into the prison. Father, we plead the blood of Jesus over them. We ask for a hedge of protection as they go and as they're in the prison and as they come out. Yes. Father, let every word 
that proceeds out of their mouth touch the heart of a prisoner. Let lives be eternally changed for the glory of God. We thank you for it, Father. Give them the wisdom uh, to say the words you have them to say. And we thank you for it. In Jesus' name, amen. 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 Well, we're going to have a glorious report one day when you get to heaven. It won't be great. You'll stand there and all these people. Thank you for giving to the Lord. Amen. I'm one that was saved. Won't that be great? That'd be awesome, man. That's the thing that we look forward to. Yes, ma'am. Um, again, I want to thank all you viewers for watching and for being with us today and for the help that you have given us. We are down. Come on, I got to get off this 1100 for one door. I need one more door, $1,100. I need someone to go to the phone, give 100 and then we'll be just at exactly 1000 and maybe someone give 1000 We need this door quickly. You saw the condition of the door. So we've got to get that in there quickly. If uh, you just want to give any part towards the door, we welcome it. And for all those who have given, I'm going to put your names on those boards, and I'm going to put scripture all over those boards just for you. Won't that be great? See you next time. Bye-bye.